quarter inch, if I'm not wrong, yeah, quarter inch thickness, I guess, or oh, it's three quarters, one of those. Okay, finish. And peel off. Oh yeah, don't peel off yet. <laughs> Let me just assemble this and make it easier for myself. Okay, so this is what she usually does. She doesn't peel it off, so she makes the box. And then after that, she peels it off so it doesn't stick all over the place. Make sure everything is nice and aligned and then you can just seal that down any tape sticking out just fold it in here oh, you can't see it too clearly okay never mind it's at the back so it's not too obvious okay so just add your velcro now this one I use the medium size which is this and if I'm not wrong it's 15 it's a 15 mm velcro dot I need to find a better way to put all these things down I need to organize all my stuff again uh, okay for this one I wanted the edges to be more decorative so I actually use my cropper towel and did this okay so I use my crop of ball and did that um, and then I'm going to stick down my velcro uh, I'm always dropping things Center. Press down. See my camera also moves when it doesn't. It's not supposed to. Stay, stay. Okay. Remove the backing and close. Okay. And I press this down. Okay, now to add the sides, the pockets. Now, if you feel that this is too plain, you can always add some something to it. Um, I'm just going to leave it. Uh, as I said, if you decorate it, it's, if it's for an adult, I'll definitely make it nice, more decorative. But since it's for kids, I don't think it's necessary. Okay, so just put more tape to the back. Copy box. And then uh, we'll stick it down.
So I just guesstimate, estimate about like a half an inch from the bottom and right in the middle on both sides. And I just uh, do this. Just press down with your bone folder on the inside. Just be careful not to make a hole in it. Okay, and then let's do the other side. We still have one final step, and that is the straps. Okay, the straps are really fast too. Okay, so we have got a one by seven inches pieces of paper. All you need to do is make sure you curl. Just curl it up. Add tape at the ends. Just press it down, make sure it will come out. Okay, and then the same thing about a quarter to three, I don't know, quarter of an inch away and about an inch or three quarters of an inch down. Just press it. Okay, then let's go to the bottom. Try to make it as straight as possible. And press this up a bit so that you get this slightly, yeah, this shape. Same thing. Total, I mean, it's like 40 minutes, this video. Let's see, let me see. I'll try to align it with the same height on this side and on this side. And just press it up a little bit. Pull, pull, and there we go. And it's done. And there we have our backpack. Ah. I love the look of it. It's so cute. Alright, so these are for my students uh, for the Children's Day that's coming up next... Is it next week? Yeah, it's next week. Oh, maybe it's this week. I can't remember. No, it's next week. It's October next week. Okay, this week is still September. Alright, so a fun project. Uh, you can embellish it. I am planning to embellish this more. Um, I added some stickers to the side of this one. Not sure I'm going to do this to this. I think I showed in a previous haul video I had some stickers. These rainbow ones, they are so cute. So I'm going to use something from this sticker pack. Very quickly, I'm just going to add it. Okay. I don't want this to be too long. I think I'm going to use the, this gem. All right since that was a gem on the other side. So I'm going to use this gem, just center it, and press it down. There we go, and like 
unfortunately there's two of each gem here so I'm gonna use okay my fingers are in the way I can see what's in the center all right so I just peel this off so I can press it down and there we have it okay I'm gonna put something else here I don't know whether I should put a ball Oh, something else. Hmm. We'll have to see. Okay, so that is for today's project. Backpack. Alright, the link uh, to the original video would be in the description box below. I hope you enjoyed this and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.